the amazing journey of a raindrop. Hey there, kids. It's me, Weeju. Have you ever wondered where the rain comes from? Today, we're going to follow a raindrop on its incredible journey through the rain cycle. Are you ready? Let's go. Our journey begins with the sun. When the sun heats up the water in lakes, rivers, and oceans, something magical happens. The water turns into invisible gas called water vapor. This process is called evaporation. Look, there goes a water drop turning into vapor and floating up, up, up into the sky. Once our raindrop reaches the sky, it cools down and changes back into tiny water droplets. These droplets come together to form clouds. This is called condensation. See how the clouds are getting bigger and darker? That means they're full of water droplets, just like our raindrop. When the clouds get too heavy with water, they let it all go. This is called precipitation. It could be rain, snow, sleet, or hail. But today it's rain. Look, our little raindrop is falling back down to earth, where it might flow into a river, soak into the soil, or find its way back to the ocean. This is called collection. And guess what? The cycle starts all over again. And that's the amazing journey of a raindrop in the water cycle. From evaporation to condensation, then precipitation and collection. Next time you see rain, you'll know all about where it comes from. Thanks for joining us on this rainy adventure. See you next time. <laughs>